This is the most biggest thing that happened in my life ever. I can't wait till I tell my mom. It was his brother, and I would speak to him, mom, and he was my mentor, mom. Medical plan will pay for 100% stop smoking. I promise you, mom. Okay. I think that would be terrific. That would. You would, would like that? Oh, I would like that. Okay, that type of a career path would allow you to provide more for your family as well. A single woman runs a whole plant all by herself, and the undercover boss is in awe of how that's possible. He goes undercover to learn more, and the more he learns, the more he's impressed. She shows him her day-by-day -day routine. Do you ever sit, or is that... Occasionally. Just... We have not cleaned that off. Cindy certainly seemed to have a very good handle on that. Anyone could do that. He truthfully admits that he definitely can't do the things she does, and even if he can, not to the most efficient level in which she does it. She runs, fast walks all around the plant, and almost never sits, and as she takes the undercover boss on the tour, he seems to be lagging behind. I'm gonna load another truck. I'm used to being by myself all right, all right. Pretty darn single. Uh, I've got a seven-year-old grandson I could do. How much? Seven. She tells the undercover boss that she has a grandson that sometimes helps her on or off the switch. Her daughter lives with them, so her grandson sometimes comes to visit her at work. Then she reveals the undercover boss that she does smoke cigarettes. Actually, that's Ray and Mark. You're smoking cigarettes and her grandson and how much she has to live for. I was very surprised. Cut way back. Yeah. Undercover boss says that's when he first arrived. He had mid-range expectations, but now that he's working with her, he's learned so much more than he set his mind to. Well, that counts for everything. When I first arrived, I thought all I was going to learn about was how the centrifuge works. You need to have a lot of different skills. You have to have your wits about you. What you doing Monday? <laughs> Undercover boss reveals himself and tells her how impressed he is by her hard work and dedication to the job. But he does have something to talk to her about, and it's her smoking. Well, she does know it's bad, and she says she's been trying to quit, but we all know how addiction works. It's not crystal plain simple, but it needs a lot of time and dedication to quit. Undercover boss is really determined to help her stop smoking and even pays for it. Medical plan will pay for 100% stop smoking. Okay, oh. so you mentioned something about a grandson. Right. Nadlin, yes. Grandson. grandson gets off to a strong start. We are going to set up a $5,000 education fund for him. Undercover boss Manuel is doing the labor work and we all know they are never built for those. He's packing products from the belt into package boxes and he's been supervised by a woman who makes him know how slow he is every second of him working. It's really something. Can you do it a little bit faster? Are you kidding? You have to be careful because the back guy is rolling in the park. His trainer that's with him is done with his 15 minutes and helps Manuel get through his, but the job is really hard for Manuel. His trainer says Manuel is good for the office, but for physical work because he's kind of slow and can slow down productivity. Undercover boss asks the employee how long it takes to learn, and the employee says it takes the most of one day. Like at least one day. How many people do you hire? We actually did some cutbacks, and we, they let some people go. So I was fortunate to stay in the company. His trainer says he was demoted from his former job because of the way the economy is going. His pay is cut, but he says that that's better than being jobless, so he stayed with the job. He tells the undercover boss that he's married with two kids and his first child is nine years old. Has the capacity to do even more. Two kids, I got a nine-year-old and I got a, a four-year-old. My mom kind of is, taking, is raising them and my mom speaks only Spanish. His trainer says his wife works in the school district and they only see each other sometimes because she leaves the house too early and he gets home very late. The undercover boss is impressed, but when the undercover boss asks his trainer if he was the supervisor, would he hire him? So he's a good trainer. He wants and likes his job. Would you hire me? Kind of um, let's see back here. Undercover boss reveals himself and he tells him that he's impressed with his work. Undercover boss tells him that he wants to enroll him in a supervisory training program so they can promote him as soon as possible. Undercover boss also tells him that there's a managerial spot for him because of how welcoming, positive, and hospitable he is. He also says he's going to be his mentor. Well, that's a great turn of events. I want to enroll you in a supervisory training program. It you would, would like that? Oh, I would like that. Okay, having 
that type of a career path would allow you to provide more for your family as well. Undercover Boss is inspired by the 24-year-old single mother working in a nursing home taking care of the elderly. She tells the Undercover Boss that she's almost done with school and she also wants to start her own nursing home. Uh, the last route. I eventually want to open up my own nursing home. She's just so focused on the future, seeing what she might choose for herself over the next few years. Undercover boss reveals herself and tells her that working with her was really inspiring because her drive and ambition to go after what she wants for herself and her family is really powerful. She tells her that they're starting a new branch and they want it there as her franchise because she's a passionate and hard worker. Arrangements so that that territory could be your franchise. No way. And I will work with you to try to secure. We would be very lucky to have you in the Bright Star family. Undercover Boss rewards employees hard work with a detailed mentorship program with Undercover Boss as the mentor to help him become fully ready to become a franchise owner. It shocks the employees so much that he's speechless. I think working together, I'm pretty confident that you'll become our youngest when the time comes and you're qualified and you're ready to start that process. Undercover Boss says when he's fully ready to start his franchise, the first $25,000 is going to come from him. The employee feels like he's in a dream and really doesn't know what to say. He calls his mother right after to tell her the good news. Like, I'm only 19 and this is the most biggest thing that happened in my life ever. I can't wait to tell my mom. It was the brother. And I was speaking to him, mom, and he was my mentor, mom.